Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. I'm going to go through using templates on card.co and I'm going to show you how to use the templates to your advantage. So let's get in. What you want to do um, from this page is go over to the top right hand side and hit new site. Now you're going to create a new site. Now there's a few things that you can do here, right? Instead of creating a new site directly with a blank canvas, we can go ahead and use a template. Now they have quite a few options in terms of types of templates. Okay. So let's say uh, perhaps we are uh, creating a landing page all right so here are a few templates of landing pages now i'm going to jump in um, to this one over here that looks pretty cool now you can hit the select button on that uh, template and it'll load up now as you can see it's just giving you some instructions it's very very simple we're going to just say okay and got it and we're going to go through it now this is the part where you get to fully customize absolutely everything okay so whatever you click on whatever image you click on right um, image be it text whatever element you are clicking on you will have some options coming up on the left hand side now if you're clicking in this area on the sides it'll be your background and here you can fully customize your background so you can go on the left hand side and you can completely customize this so you can change the color okay let's make it this crazy weird color to make it red okay we can now also change our pattern let's make it like that we can also change the alternate um color over here so let's make it like something crazy like that we can also then change the thickness of that okay and then we click on done all of those options now have been changed now if you if you inside of the page you'll see that there is a page option that comes up and this is um some of the page options that you can see so you can see here right this is what that looks like that's what that looks like and you can just go ahead and you can change all of the page details right you can also center your um your your page so let's say we want to center it to the right and let's say we want to change it to a wide box Okay, um, or a tall box. So now we have everything happening here on the right hand side. We can also change the width of the page. That's absolutely fantastic. So we can have a background running here. Maybe you have an image running in the background and you can pretty much change everything else about it. We're going to hit done. And if we're touching that background again, we can go ahead and we can choose either um, a gradient image, video, slideshow. So you can choose whatever you want to make your background. As far as the other elements are concerned, you're going to tap on any single element and you can go ahead and you can customize it. You can enter some alt text, you can um, enter a URL, um, and then there are some additional options. And then over here is the upload button where you will actually upload your own data. Okay, um, again with the text it'll give you an indication of what element this is. So this is text, so let's click on this. And here you can change anything that you would like to okay so you can enter that in here also you have the type of text so there's subheading paragraph main heading text um, and then also you have um, some markdown formatting so you can just go ahead and do these um, commands with your text and it'll change the text style all right Again, we can go down and we can manage everything that we want to in here just by clicking on it and changing those elements. Now, let's say we want to add an additional element. We're going to go ahead, hit this plus button, and you can now enter in whatever it is that you'd like, such as a table. Now, here's this table over here. And um, let's say that we would like to um, customize it. We're going to click on the table. On the left-hand side here, you have all of the options in the table. So you have your columns, uh, headings, rows, and then you can have all of your text style uh, change there. Now, let's say we want to move this. We're going to click down and we can literally just go ahead and drag it wherever we want. And there'll be a line to tell you where it's going to go. All right. Here's a button that we can add. Uh, edit over here so you can change the label, the icon. Uh, you can see there's tons of icons. Really, there's lots of icons over here. Um, so let's say we want to... Um, have this icon over here and then you can enter in your URL 
So when somebody clicks on it, that's where they will go. And again, you can customize everything about the look and the feel of that button. Now, once you're done, you're going to go ahead and you're going to hit this um, publish this site button and you'll have some options. And now the site has been completely customized to your liking. And um, this can really be something absolutely wonderful. You can do absolutely anything you want with this uh, with this template. If this was a helpful guide, please do show your support. Hit us with a like and we will see you in another awesome video. Happy building people.